If she don't have a boyfriend, oh my goodness, she gonna, she gonna find like a three or four. <laughs> special vlog because this is gonna be my big deal video so yeah if you're new here hey girl welcome to the homegirl gang and yeah if you're new here my name is Kyra and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and this is about to be a journey and I'm taking y'all along with me it's gonna be lit so yeah so I just got to Miami and I just checked into my Airbnb um oh I gotta click start checking but um yeah we got to our Airbnb Girl, I mean, it looked just like the pictures, but the neighborhood says a little scary, but it's okay, it'll, it'll do. So I'm gonna show y'all around and show y'all um, everything. The bathrooms are cute, I ain't gonna lie to you. So this is, sorry, my mom is here. She's um, sanitizing everything. So the sink is running. But anyway, so this is the door. The door is like a, like no key you gotta do digit and this is the living room and then that's the kitchen super nice super modern and then the bathrooms are so cute the black marble and the black finishes is so cute this is exactly how i will want my bathroom but yeah there's three bedrooms in here i know four bedrooms and they're real nice real modern and then it's another bedroom these bedrooms all look the same this is the base the big bathroom look at my hair and then this shower is so cute like i can't even but i don't know what they like what is that somebody I feel like that's a moldy ass towel. Like, why is that right there? Who would want to step on that? If you did, I'm judging you. I don't care. But yeah. And then that's just another bedroom. So one, two, four. And then there has its own bathroom. Yeah, we just got here. We're settling in. We're about to disinfect everything. And we still need to go to the store because I got to get a waterproof um, mattress. I mean a waterproof like mattress liner thing so if i'm bleeding or whatever it won't soak through the mattress because i'm not paying for nothing i ain't trying to get no extra fee so yeah but girl and then another thing about this place is that i'm not the washer and dryer is outside in a different area like you got to put a coat in and everything like who wants to take their clothes to another part but yeah like i'm saying the people that were probably here before us didn't leave a review and said that so but yeah so we're just gonna disinfect everything and i'm just gonna um i actually have some i don't know if it's echoing in here it is i'm sorry but yeah i i just have to do um some work and stuff and tomorrow's my pre-up at 8 a.m so i just want to get that done before um i go to my pre-op tomorrow and then i gotta turn it in a video so but yeah y'all this is gonna be crazy i can't believe i'm finally doing this but let me go wash my hands and start disinfecting because that's just the first thing i need to do so let's get to it right, so we just got back we went to walmart we went to wingstop y'all i'm so happy i know a little bit of spanish because my uber driver i was like um can you stop and get us something to eat 
I was like, please, por favor. <laughs> and then he was like, un, I was like, un stapo. <laughs> no, I didn't say un stapo. I said comido. I was like, comido, just uno, uno stop. But yeah, y'all, so, oh my God. No, this not what's gonna happen. That's why it really got me fucked up. I don't like bugs and y'all our uber rider uber driver was trash we had all these fucking groceries and obviously we're two females and this motherfucker did not get out to help us so but whatever it's cool oh the camera not even on me anyway so i'm about to eat my wing stop i haven't had wing stop in forever and i gotta edit my video so that's what i'm gonna do and tomorrow is pre-op at 8 a.m so, and I'm gonna take a shower and, but yeah, we got a lot of stuff. We got groceries. <sighs> so yeah, but I just cannot get over this neighborhood we in, but we got everything. And tomorrow we're gonna go to Whole Foods. So yeah. Um, but yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a work girl. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to, um eat my food and i'll talk to y'all once i guess i'll talk to y'all tomorrow actually once i get to free up so yeah y'all so y'all um we just set up my bed um if you sleep on airbnb's sheets you're nasty that's just ugh. like even hotels like it's a little iffy nowadays but um so yeah, I'm about to just get in the shower and tomorrow's my pre-up, like I said. So, y'all, my mom just cried. She's like, oh my god, I hope it works out. I hope. I mean, of course, your mom is gonna have her opinion, but I'm like, really? I think it's just the stress over this neighborhood and everything. I'm gonna show y'all the neighborhood when I go in the morning, but it's okay. God got us. Um, we just gonna stick it out and do what we gotta do. Okay. So, um, yeah. So I got all these sheets and stuff from Walmart and new pillowcases, everything. So, yeah. And hopefully, when we go to Whole Foods tomorrow, hopefully, you guys, they have some more disinfectant spray. But yeah. So I'm just gonna get in the bed, start editing, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. I just made it to my pre-op appointment, but I just read the sign that said stay in your car until your appointment time, just due to COVID. So I'm just gonna stay down here for 15 minutes um, until my appointment, because I don't wanna go up there. And they be like, oh no, you need to go, boo. And I don't got time. So yeah, but it's early as hell, it's 8.30. Y'all, when I go back to my Airbnb, I'm gonna show y'all the neighborhood we're in. <coughs> Um, but anyway, I barely got, me and my mom barely got any sleep last night. We was literally just not comfortable. So we booked another Airbnb in a better neighborhood and it's a building. And, um, so I'm going to show y'all that once we get there. Cause after this, I'm going to, I'm going to go back and we're going to pack my stuff and we're going to go. So yeah. And I'm. I'm telling that man, like, I want my lady back. You're proud. Like, I'm going to show y'all the neighborhood, the outside, and then my insert pictures of the Airbnb just to show y'all, like, yeah, tragic. But, hey, it had to be us, but it's okay. So, I'll probably never, ever book another Airbnb. Ever. But, anyway. I need my fucking life away. Now, let me show y'all 
Let me show y'all how ghetto this shit is. But look at this neighborhood. Bitch, look at the gate. Like, we don't feel safe. We gotta go. Mm -mm. He fought us. But, yeah. I did not want to. Okay, y'all. So, we're at our new hotel because we was not staying in little haiti i'm sorry miami is ghetto y'all ghetto like everywhere is ghetto and i posted something on the facebook group or whatnot and they're like everything in miami is ghetto girl unless you go to brickwell or south beach period there's nothing else so i was like okay so we just you know last minute So anyway, you can't please a Virgo. I'm sorry, my mother's a Virgo. She just, she's ready to go home, honestly. And we're only on day two. But anyway, this is our new hotel. It's real cute. I love the bathroom. I think it's real nice. Real cute. Mm -hmm. And it's a walk-in shower. Woo, woo, woo. Bed. We only got one bed because um, that's all they have with the washer and dryer. And she gonna sleep on the couch, but she not pulling it out. So now we are back to disinfecting. Um, there is a view. Let me show y'all. Probably. What's this? How do you open this? Oh. This balcony is kind of ugly. Oh, I wanted to go to Chrome Heart. It is surgery day. I look ugly. And <laughs> I didn't get no sleep last night because I was up working on a sponsorship. But anyway, I'm about to take a bath in this with this and dial soap just to make sure I got everything off because I don't want no infection. But let me show y'all my body before. Um, actually, I'm going to show y'all when I get out of the shower. So my hair is tanned. But yes, eight. 15 in the morning. My surgery is at 9 15. Oh my god. I can't believe I did this shit. <gasps> it's a fatty. Red 
tinged fluid. Oh, okay. It's all from the fat that has been injected and transferred. Mm -hmm. So don't get worried about that. But fluid loss can cause hypotension. So if she feels like she's dizzy or she needs to sit down, just sit her down and give her as much salty fluid as possible. So this has low salt. Mm -hmm. The pineapple juice is high in sodium and the beet juice that you guys mm -hmm. have in there, high in sodium. Okay. So just in case something happened like that or she's walked to the bathroom and all of a sudden she gets a little dizzy, the gravity is pulling the fluid down okay. and it can cause her blood pressure to drop rapidly. Okay. So just to bring it back up, salt will do it. Okay. This is not my stuff, so I'll use it. <laughs> That's mine. Just put it for me. in her lungs and she's not draining as much but he put he put like four um six incisions one two three four five six so he's gonna monitor those and i, I wasn't able to see the front so it's most likely to do the here right here and under the bra line so what is the drainage like you know because i've seen other people like what is the, the she don't have some those things Oh, the JP drain. Yeah, so it's all up I to. I don't think he do that. Yeah, yeah, it's all up to the That's doctor. That's why you get a massage. Oh. No, it's basically up to the doctor and the specific type of procedure. So I know most doctors, when ladies get tummy tucked, okay. they like the JP drain. Okay. A lot of doctors like the fluid to come out, and then you can see results faster. Oh, okay. So she'll yeah. be less swollen and more. more oh, okay. Fluid. And then the fat drain and massage also helps you get rid of that fluid. Oh, okay. It also prevents fibrosis. Which is like little bumps on the body. Um, I don't know if you guys seen Cardi B's stomach, but she has a lot of fibrosis. It's gonna help smooth out the skin too. Okay. Sorry, it's Cardi B. Cardi B. Let me go see if walking. Is this um? Is this a fresh one? Mm, no, but you can go. So I can delete some stuff off there, but later um, you can go to Walgreens and see if they got that really Wait. Yeah, the but that's the one you need. You really don't need anything on this one? <laughs> Some images, not all. But it's enough space on it. Okay. okay, so we're going to be giving an IM injection. It's intramuscular with um, basically we call it our ass shot. It's going to preserve all the fat cells that are potentially lost after you get a BBL. So after you get a BBL, 30% of the volume is gone because you're sitting on it and just fat cells die. That's just what they do. So this, this vitamin potentially is going to preserve some of those fat cells and it's just going to be a quick IM injection. Yeah. So we got to see like where she would want it. What do you want it, Kyra? No. Okay, hold on. Scare needles? <laughs> no. How are you feeling right now? Um, I'm feeling fine. I think the purpose it helped a lot. It's my booty still like <clears throat> I did like a whole bunch of squats. Yeah. I know I'm ugly right now, but whatever. No yeah. way, your skin is amazing. Yeah. And you won't stop how you're supposed right. to do it again. <laughs> all right. So when you see all the pink bags, this is what's in it. And everybody has the pink drips. B12 and folic acid is pink. There you go. <laughs> Okay, so I think I just give it in the arm real quick. So she's got an arm lipo already. I'm 
I'm done with that. That was fast. <laughs> Sharps container, guys. Our Sharps container is in the car. Hey guys, hi, we're here with Kyra. So we are stay are in. We are a nursing concierge service. So basically we cater to typically out of state clients who choose to get plastic surgery and who would like registered nurses, CNAs and HHAs to care for them. So right now, um, Kyra is a few hours post-op doing amazingly well. So some of the services that we provide are hemoglobin monitoring because um, contrary to popular belief, you are in typically an unstable condition. So we wanna monitor your hemoglobin, how much blood you're losing, the fluids you're losing. We also provide um, IV fluids as well as different IM injections. So you just see me give her a B12 shot with folic acid. If you look on our website, it's called the ASH shot and it stimulates your red blood cells and typically keep that volume that you pay for it. Yep. <laughs> I'm not good with cameras. You better get used to it. Didn't you just do one? Yes. Well, I'm going to be <laughs> vlogging and stuff. But, yep. So, we're here taking care of her. She is doing very well. We're going to definitely keep updates um, on Kyra. Y'all need to book them the best. I swear. I don't think I had a better service from a nurse in real life ever. Swear. I don't think I would be comfortable without them, to be honest. I mean, I got my mama, but listen, homegirl is educational, okay? Okay, you're and for me. <laughs> well, I ain't doing nothing. <laughs> listen, that's how my mom you are. was last week with Chastity. I got a breast lift done, that's why I really can't do too much. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, call Chastity, Chastity knows what to do. Oh my God. <laughs> and I was like, you didn't give him the my talk before? The same way, though. I'm gonna get your... Looking Shut good, looking amazing. What's the waist? Yeah, so let's try to get her like walking. You feel comfortable? You want right? to start walking? Yeah. So it's all about upper body strength. Unfortunately, you got your arms done too, so it's easier said than done. Yeah. Put your little right there, Chaz. Can you help me with your slippers? What do you got? Her socks is fine. Yeah, her socks is fine. I will change this out. She's booty. I don't want to see it. <laughs> no, you look really good. So, like, get her walking. <laughs> it doesn't hurt? No, it's just my arm sore. Sore. He definitely did a really wow. amazing job. Yeah, he did. Stand straight, stand sideways, <laughs> straight up as you can. Oh. Yeah, and she has padding this side, so oh, sure. she has padding. And then tomorrow, maybe when you take it off, you'll be able to see the laterals, the hips. Yeah, there's something back there. Oh, there's spilling. It's spilling? Uh oh, yeah, she's leaking. Let me. So we're gonna take it off and put the AED pack. Okay. Oh, your boobs. So, or you might have to put it in before I come, have your mom put it in, and so it could be ready by the time you get, you know, back from your post office massage. Put what in? Right, what, I, garment? I thought I had to stay in it. It could be out of it for like an hour, two hours, at least. Oh. Uh, I don't know. Why, right? what's wrong? Yeah. Because I want to wash it. Well, you can wait until after she needs the way to Yeah, I'll just wait, wait till her post stop, yeah. To wash it um before you go to the post up. No, you can wash it after. 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 She could be without the compression for two hours. Okay. She feels like lightheaded though, so she gonna lay back down. So mom, we have to give her a lot of fluids. Okay. okay. What so, a lot of fluids? Yeah, I need the air on. I put the air on, Popo. Mm -hmm. You find it? 
No, I'm back to the point. It annoyed me too. Mm -hmm. That the less that I work, right. and you know, you may think I'm a charity and I'm a charitable work. Oh, all right. I do really want kids and, you know, I come from with a family pretty close. We're all really close together, so family for me is important. So, so I appreciate me to make the... Do you think he's just jealous because Did it's the biggest part the broker just ever had? Uh, there is an ego involved in my opinion. Could be. I mean, I see his point. He doesn't want you to waste sure, time. Sure. But you know what? Those listings sit on the market for two years and then someone come and low below. Oh, 50 million. And you know what? Maybe Adam will say... Okay. Yeah. You know what, Davina? I was Takes thinking time. about it. Yeah. overseas and building he, other guy such a poker face. Like, yeah. Yeah. No. true emotion in yeah. he has been like, scary. Like, not the one. Yeah, he's scary? Really? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's scary at first. Don't because of that. Yeah. 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 Just fucking. Yeah. 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 I don't know why I'm so annoyed. I feel like we're spending a lot of energy on Davina's $75 million listing. Can I talk to you for a second? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, cool. I don't have much. So I'm vlogging off my phone. Um. Is my butt. Um, I passed out twice peeing, y'all, because I was drinking so many fluids, and I haven't been really getting salty foods. And I don't know if y'all know this, I already have low blood pressure, so um, yeah, I passed out twice, but it was only for like a second, and then um. Yeah, so it's only seven. My first massage is at why is my eye bruised? My first massage is at um ten five o'clock, but my pre op appointment, post op appointment is at eleven. So I gotta get ready for that. But yeah, I'm just stiff and I can't wait to get a massage. So I can feel a little better. But yeah. This is day one. I'm bleeding every fucking way. Well, not everywhere, but just the front part. And yeah, I'll show y'all once. Well, I haven't really looked at my body because I really don't feel like looking at all that shit. And I don't got my contacts in. So, but yeah. Ah, this is a journey. But I will talk to y'all once after I get my other massage. Well, my first massage. Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Okay y'all, uh, this is what it's looking like. Nasty. This is shape. I'm swollen as ever. My arm just bruised. But yeah. So. But. Um, okay, bye. Yeah. And then, um. Well, get your uh, uh, shower shoes on, bro. I got a sponge for her. You want, um, I don't think they gave us no wash cloth in here. Hey, y'all. Uh, oh, my God. My lips is pink. But, oh, I had that acai bowl earlier. But, um, day one is almost over. This is what it's looking like. And I'm about to get in the shower. I just had my first massage. But y'all, if I then I know I came with my mama. But if I did not have the two nurses that's with me right now, I would be fucking, I don't know. Thank God for chastity. I know, thank God for chastity. Aww. Stay our in. I'm telling y'all. I don't even need that. I'll put but, the promo on <laughs> But, but my ain't they the best they showing so much love yeah. they taking care of all the girls y'all need to book them i had changed three times had a disinfect three different places oh so anyway she is about to take me well i'm about to get in the shower she's gonna clean my wounds 
I just had my first massage. I feel a little bit better. And okay. yeah. Well, let me so. just take this bottle stuff off so she can go. Okay. Take it. So that, right? Yeah. So she took that. Y'all, so they just got me all situated for tonight. Oh. First night down. Oh. What does that mean? Huh? Uh, and I'm gonna go to sleep because I'm tired. But I swear to God, I appreciate them so much. <laughs> like, I don't think I will be able to do this without them. I swear. But what? Hey y'all, so it's officially day two post op and um I'm about to get ready to go to my second massage. Why is my lip still purple? But I'm just getting some work done. I just had some avocado toast because they say avocados like basically stuff for like keto um to feed the fat like right away. So I eat that anyway. So like avocado, fish, salmon, stuff like that. And I've just been drinking Pedialyte for my second massage. Because yesterday when I went to my first massage ever, like I had to take a break. Because I already have low blood pressure. And then when fluid is leaving your body, your blood pressure is going to go down. So I had to take like a five second break and drink some water. But today I'm going to one of the best massagers and she's a little bit more rough so but yeah i'm about to just get ready and i'll take my vlog camera to my second massage so yeah Hola. <laughs> so, here we're gonna squeeze her so this is my massage lady everybody says she's the best so i had to come to her and she squeezed me in, so thank you so much. So, <laughs> if you're in Miami getting your body done, you have to get your body done. By, I mean, squeezed by her. So, you can um, just let me it see. Up let me see what one hand. Let me check. Do you see? Oh, she has waist. A snatch. Ooh, big booty here. <laughs> I don't know, but I guess if she don't have a boyfriend, oh my goodness, she's gonna. Know. She's going to find like a three or four. You need somebody? Maybe she needs somebody. <laughs> <laughs> so with these lymphatic massages, they are painful. I'm not going to lie. But I was pretty strong and I stuck through it because I knew it needed to be done because you don't want any fluid buildup. And yeah, it's just essential for you to get after surgery because you got to get rid of all that stuff out of you of all the fluid that they use to break down the fat when they do the liposuction it just feels like your stomach is like numb and then just somebody just squeezing you <laughs> i don't know how to put it in words but oh okay i'm gonna take a picture okay. and you can see the huge difference here. Yep, mm -hmm. Okay, y'all. So I just got back to the thing. My mouth is still purple because I gotta wash my face. But um, yeah. So I had my massage, and she told me to come home and take cold shower. So I did. My lips is really like it must because my mouth must be dry as fuck because my mouth is dry as hell right now but i've been up walking <clears throat> i feel very strong today um yeah so i'm about to eat some avocado toast and some tuna because you have to feed fat so you have to eat like keto diet food so that's what i'm about to do and yeah and i'm just gonna chill nothing too crazy yeah so I'll update y'all later. This is day three. Two. This is day. 
On to stay three. Two post ups. Oh. I had my, my yesterday was my one day. Oh, day two. Day 85,000 for me. Shit. This has been a rough ride, y'all. Pray for me. Help me. Help me. Oh, let me zoom in. Hey, Kyra. Kyra, I'm gonna need. Hit like, subscribe, and share. Thumbs up, thumbs down for the haters. Play your part. Holla. Stop. What you stopping for? This is what you wanted. Uh -huh. Hmm? What's wrong? This is you. Okay. But, all right. You ain't got nothing to say to the people? No. All right. Hey, y'all. You ain't going to do the hey, y'all? Hey, y'all. It is day three. Day three of my post stop. Um, yesterday, I just went to get my sleeves for my arm lipo from the store. I'll put it on the screen. And then I just got my boards and stuff on. Um, so this Baja they gave me after surgery is a little big, but it fits over my booty. So I don't want anything compressing my ass or my hips. <clears throat> so I just put the boards and stuff on and then put styrofoam on the boards to make it tight to my body. And I also have a full body like tank top on underneath it's not like i don't know how to describe the material but i look like a fucking box <laughs> but yeah so mm -hmm. so <laughs> yeah so i'm waiting on chastity because she's gonna take me to my third massage with um the lady i was at yesterday because I forgot her name, but it's the squeeze lady. So, yeah, and I had my breakfast this morning. I had two avocado toasts with bacon, pito gallo on it, and um, pediolite, and pineapple juice. So, yeah, you don't want to be on a diet, or you don't want to be like, oh, I can't eat. Um, you need to eat while doing this because... You want to feed your fat. You want to save your fat. And also, um, what was I going to say? Um, you don't want to feel lightheaded when you're going to your massages. So, and I already have blood pressure. Blood pressure so. But, yeah, so I'm just waiting on her to come. And I will talk to y'all later. But as far as pain, I'm not in pain. Um... These boards are just tight as hell. And then, yeah, I'm just walking like crippled, like a crippled person, but it's fine. Yeah, so, and I just did my hair. You ain't doing nothing? Huh? Hey, girl. Hey, y'all. We on day 95. Please help. My, my mom made me pee on myself. I did not make you pee on yourself. Anywho, meanwhile. Y'all, I feel like I'm looking like mold. I feel like I'm moldy. See that booty? I have it to the bath. Oh. 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 Hey, you. I'm waiting on my fourth massage. Fourth massage is coming up on today. <sighs> well, I need to do a documentary of the people who come along because it's some bullshit. Okay? Bye. Bye. Bye, y'all. Mm. Hey y'all, I wanna, 
Let y'all know that this heifer is really getting on my goddamn motherfucking nerves. Like, for real, I can't wait to leave, go home, because I can't take this shit no more. This is a vlog for me. Mom, Mom this is still ass. big. Why you keep on asking me that bullshit? Because I want to make sure. Okay, she keep asking me if it's going to be, if it's so big. she kept bumping it earlier. No, I can't. I, yes, you were. I did not bump it. Is it still big? I have my boards on. What does that mean? Is it still round? Oh my god, mama lips that color. Hey y'all, it is day six. Day time to go. And yesterday was Sunday, today is Monday, and I still have my boards. And I had my last massage today. Oh my god, my titties. I am. <laughs> my last massage today in here so um yeah i had my last massage today um here but i'm about to schedule one back at home once i get off the plane but my homegirls that was taking care of me they are so sweet y'all i look a mess oh my god i look a mess they sent me a edible arrangement like how did you know i like chocolate covered strawberries but i had to get this on camera before my mother demolishes them because she's been eating everything but yeah so i'm just about to take a nap you can't see him i'm just gonna take a nap and then um yeah y'all i'm still so sore and um yeah today i was just not feeling it i was very weak um I had ramen noodles yesterday and today. I don't think I can have that anymore. That made me real weak. I don't know. But I was just craving it. Y'all know that hood meal or whatever. So, yeah, I'm just about to chill. Tomorrow we leave. And I'm so excited to get the fuck out of here. Like, I'm excited to be back home in my bed. And, yeah. Aren't you? <laughs> but I swear, y'all, this BBL journey is really sucking the life out of me. Look at my lips. Like, I feel like they look purple. Like, they have no life to them. Like, I don't know. But, yeah, so. Leave me alone. Anyway, so I'm going to take a nap because I haven't took a nap today since my massage. And look at my lips. I just can't get over it. And yeah, I will talk to y'all later. Yeah, so I'm home now. And I just wanted to end the video off because, like, this surgery has really been sucking the life out of me. Like, look at my lips. I thought it was, I don't know why they're purple. And my eyes, I think I'm having an allergic reaction right now because when I came home, I had um, <clears throat> some chicken taco lettuce wraps from the Cheesecake Factory, like, on my way from the airport in Chicago. But, y'all, like, I... I'm so worn out. Like, I just need to rest and heal. I'm just, uh, this surgery has really taken a lot out of me. Like, if you can't tell. So, yeah, I'm just ending this video off and I'll see y'all in the next one.